This episode was brought to you by Pentester Academy, the leader in online cybersecurity education. Join over 10,000 professionals from 90 countries to learn security online. Also brought to you by Hacker Arsenal, artillery for cyber warriors. Visit us on HackerArsenal.com to check out our latest attack defense gadgets. I'm Marley Oxenholm from Pentester Academy TV, and welcome to our show, The Toolbox, where we showcase the latest and greatest software tools so you can use them to better your security. I have a great tool to show you guys today. Let's take a look at Wi-Fi Fisher. Wi-Fi Fisher is a fully automated custom phishing attack tool for Wi-Fi clients. This tool is written in Python and it hosts an evil twin Wi-Fi network, forces the client device to connect to it and then shows a fake page to steal credentials or to serve exploits. It also supports multiple fake pages such as firmware upgrade page, browse plugin update page and browser connecting reset page. Wi-Fi Fisher was developed by Greek security researcher George Chassou Fernu. Now, you're probably wondering how to use this tool. Well, take a look at this great example. Wi-Fi Fisher hosts an evil twin and forcefully disconnects the connected client from the legitimate access point. Hence, it requires two wireless cards, one for hosting the evil twin and the other in monitor mode to send deauthentication packets. After connecting the cards, we need to put one card into monitor mode on the channel of the target SSID. In this case, it's channel 6. We can check the various options available in Wi-Fi Fisher and then we can launch the attack by firing the command with flags AI and JI. AI specifies the card for hosting the evil twin and JI specifies the card for deauthentication attack. Wi-Fi Fisher will scan for all available SSIDs and ask the user to select the target SSID and phishing page. After this, it will create an evil twin and start sending the deauthentication packets to connected clients. We can observe in the demo that the phone got disconnected from the SSID. Even if the user reconnects to the real SSID, it will again be disconnected. Now, if a user connects to the evil twin, which is an open network, a pop-up will appear on the device, which will then redirect the user to the hosted phishing page. Like other phishing attacks, this attack also relies on the user to make a mistake. If the user believes the page to be legitimate, they will enter a pre-shared key, which will be logged by the Wi-Fi phisher. After getting the pre-shared key, the Wi-Fi Fisher automatically stops all deauthentication, flood, and phishing attacks. This comes in handy when the target user is not well aware of such attacks. Instead of trying to brute force the WPA PSK handshake, which might even be impossible to crack in the case of a strong password. This attack can get the pre-shared key easily. Well, that's all the time I have for you guys today. Thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed this tool breakdown. Be sure to tune in next time for another episode of The Toolbox. Also, make sure to subscribe to our YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook so you don't miss out on any of the latest cybersecurity news. This episode was brought to you by Pentester Academy TV, the leader in online cybersecurity education. Join over 10,000 professionals from 90 countries to learn security online. Also brought to you by Hacker Arsenal, artillery for cyber warriors. Be sure to check out our latest attack defense gadgets on HackerArsenal.com. Thanks for watching and we'll see you next time.